as a buyer I'm interested in first checking my open invoices and aging debts before I start ordering. I open up my invoices list. I select an invoice to pay online using any one of the many payment gateways that integrate directly to Peppery. I now go back to the home page to view the special promotions configured for my account and product categories relevant to me. The experience feels as familiar to me as one of a consumer shopping online. Since we have multiple stores in our chain and I oversee ordering for them all, I select the store I want to order for. And I start my order by clicking on one of the beverage specials that is offered to me. This promotion offers buy 10 and get 5% off. This beverage is sold in singles and boxes units of measure, so I can either add 10 or more singles or order 10 piece boxes to be eligible for the discount. I'm adding more products to my order. It's easy to navigate the catalog with the dynamic filters. In addition to the special promotions, you can display offers such as free shipping for orders above $500. As a buyer, I can save products that I think I will consider buying next time I order. I open my wish list and see a cheese that I want to buy. I click on this cheese. The distributor presented me with a list of related items that I may also be interested in buying. I add some related items to the card as well. Now I want to review my order. I go to my cart, I review my order, I see that I got the promotion discounts. I can conveniently see the order weight, my contract account discount, my credit limit as a result of this order total, and the shipping cost, which are automatically calculated. As I submit my order, I am alerted that adding a bit more to the cart will get me the free shipping advertised in the catalog earlier. So, I add a couple of more items and see that shipping has gone down to $0. I submit my order. The usual delivery from my store is next day. However, in this case the Peppery system informs me that it's later than the cutoff time set by my distributor, and therefore I won't get next day. I decide to accept this. As soon as I submit my order, the sales rep assigned to my account is notified, and I get a confirmation email. Of course, the order will automatically be integrated to the ERP system, where it will be sent for processing, shipping, invoicing, etc. I can always view the status of all of my orders in my history area, whether I submitted them myself via Peppery, or if the sales rep submitted them via the Peppery Field Sales app. The most up-to-date status sent to Peppery from the ERP will be displayed here. At another time, I may want to request a quote for special products, which I can do easily, using the same style interface but different business logic behind it, which won't enforce cutoff times or give free shipping, but will make sure I'm only shown items that are relevant to this order type. I'll submit the quote request, and my sales rep will receive and respond with an update I can view in my activity list. The inventory and sales systems in my chain can generate an Excel sheet of all the items that are expected to be short of supply for my stores. I can easily submit this Excel. And it will be immediately converted to a peppery order and placed in my cart, where I can view all the special discounts and terms. In addition, peppery allows me to view your documents, which will open a folder of assets specific for my store profile, where I view PDF agreements. I watch a training video about the beverages I am selling. And I download a product image I'll use in my next marketing campaign or any other digital assets that I may need from this distributor. These assets are accessible to my specific store profile via Peppery Content Management Solution. Another really convenient way for me to order is to download Peppery's mobile app to my phone or tablet, or the Distributor Foodies private label version of the Peppery app. All the same functionality, business workflow and configuration are there on the mobile app, making the experience fully cross-platform. The added bonus using the mobile app is the ability to walk around my store or warehouse and scan products on the shelf straight into my order using the device's camera. If I happen to be offline, the mobile app will fully work as well syncing everything back to the peppery cloud as soon as I'm back online.
as you can see, as a buyer I'm provided with a single solution that covers all my commercial needs and enables me to self-serve in all the areas of e-commerce I face with my distributor.